Ja tu by mal na druhej strane, že nechal to tu smeriť v celom dome. Zavrite okná, neviem. Ty ako že zavri okná, no ty si zavri okná. Než sa tečíš presne. Hello guys, my name is Doak and in this video we will take a look at something what happened to me during the painting of the piece from the last video. This video. It was not a good experience and I didn't want to destroy the video with it so we'll take a look at it right now over here. During my 12 years of painting I had to deal with a lot of stuff, uh, especially people such as homeless people, angry moms, kids angry and drunk kids, police. You know, in my country, when you paint graffiti, about 70% of people don't really like you. There are multiple reasons for this, such as they don't understand what you paint, or they understand what you paint, but they don't like it, or they think that you are the guy who destroyed their house, or, yeah, this is not really important right now. You know, I've been painting at this wall in my hood. It's a great wall in terms of wall, but apart from that, everything else is just Terrible. First of all, there are cars everywhere and I've already had an argument with one man because of that. He thought that I, that my spray paint will destroy the cars. Also the wall is situated in the middle of a lot of buildings and flats, which means a lot of people, which means a lot of problems. If you paint something what they don't really like, they'll tell you or they won't tell you, but they'll be like, it's awful. You know, I get it. I basically understand it. And most of the time I'm willing to talk about these problems with people, with strangers, but there is this one type of behavior that I truly hate. So let's watch what exactly happened. The guy was an owner of the house standing right next to the wall. Ja tu bývam z druhej strany. Ja čo mám robiť? No tak som chod sviekať, ten to nejde do piči. Čiže ja tu bývam na druhej strane, čiže nechal to tu smeriť v celom dome. To be honest, at this point I didn't really know what to say, because nobody ever had a problem with the smell of my spray paint. Zavrite okná, neviem. Ja akože zavrite okná, no ty si zavrite okná do piči, to chod sviekať domov, na vás môžu. After this sentence I have realized that this is not a nice guy. Odstrieka domov, na vás môj úr. Prestaňte byť na mňa takýchto, dobre? No neprestanem. Tu je povolená stena. To mňa nezaujíma, že tam je nejaký pridebaný úradník, čo nerozmýšľa. Mňa na to tiež nezaujíma, čo? Tak môžete dojsť a povedať mi to kľudia. Ja to hovorím furt niekomu do piči. Ja to hovorím furt niekomu. Furt to hovorím už piatému. Áno. Alebo začiatému. No tak si ticho strikať hentá do piče. Ja sa nemám čo stiažovať. Tam sú priebaní ľudia, ktorí nevedia, tam majú ísť. This is the thing that I hate. When somebody treats you like you are 12 years old. Like you are a piece of shit. And when something like this happens, I have a bad habit to... to fight back. Although it would be much better to stay calm. Oni sedia a kúkajú do papierov. Oni vidia stenu. Čo sa tu? Jura, ja vám do hore alebo kde? To smrdí jak svinia. Ja nemám len takú masku. Dobre, poprvé si to mohli dosť povedať skôr. No tak si to teraz, ja som teraz vyšiel von. Aha, ale smrdí to už celý deň, hej? No si, ale že mi to teraz hovorí, či ja som našiel domov. Aha, dobre. No, dobre. Over here I'm starting to realize what's the problem. And I have to say that I basically agree with him. If you tell me the problem right now, I would say, yeah, it's a problem. Just as I told you in the beginning, the wall isn't, it's not the best wall for a, for a legal wall, for graffiti. No, tak si to chod striekať, hen tam niekde, im to nevadí asi, mne to vadí, my to máme na druhej strane, už aj tak ide trestné ozami na prokuratúru, takže to sa bude riešiť. Dobre, tak je to trestnom strieľným... No tak si chod si preč. Ja nikam nejdem. No ja ťa osriekať zadicov. He say that authorities are already dealing with this problem, which was completely okay with me. The problem was that he told me to leave. In the middle of the painting, he wanted me to leave. Vy ma ostriekáte zadicov, tak zavolám policiu. No zavolaj. A čo? Čekaj, kde polieva. Tu je, za koľko budeš mokrieť niž. Dobre, dobre. Však uvidíš, sa vrátim a budeš baviť a potom foťačiť. Dobre. And the conflict escalated because he wanted to force me to leave with a water from his garden, and I say that I'm looking forward to it. What are you doing? Hey, how are you? 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 How are
Chceš? A kto staň po Ube? No, tak dostaneš po Ube. Áno? Hej. Ale... Chod si strieka tam, kde bývaš, a nie tu. Ja bývam tu, na mne, kde. Kde? Tuto? Na druhej strane? Tak si chod dostriekať svoj vlastný dom. Chod si nám striekať. Ja si to nemôžem, to niekto povoril. To je náš plot. Dobre, je to v riešení. No. Není to v riešení, to je, to je niečo iné. To není v riešení. Keď chceš, chod si striekať len tam. Once again, he was basically right, and I didn't want to paint at that spot, but the problem was that there were cars everywhere, and I didn't have a choice. I had to pick the spot where I... I had to pick the spot next to his house. He really wanted me to leave. And here comes my favorite moment, the confirmation of his beautiful personality. If you think that this is the end, mm -mm, the best stuff is coming right now. Dobre, prosím vás. Nezaberaj chodník, ti hovorím, sa prejdem a ti zhodím ten fotoaparát. Zaberáš chodník, samozrejme, že ty máš právo zaberať chodník. I was not a target anymore, instead he picked my camera. Čo tu bude obchádzať? Nemám právo zaberať chodník. Nemáš právo zaberať chodník. Takže sem postaním svoje auto. Nemôžeš, nemôžeš, tak máš 1,5 metra a ten auto, nemôžeš zaberať chodník. Stane, dobre. I truly didn't know what to say at that moment because he was clearly just, I don't know, I still don't know what to say about this. Tak sa nauč, akože normálne správať, akože to nie je tvoj chodník. Ja sa mám nauči sa správať. Áno, nauč sa správať. Hej, nauč sa správať. And here comes the breaking point, the point where I decided to call police. Daj to preč, toto. Daj si to vláte, si to zober a chod si to piče. Ti hovorím už vážne. No ma už sereš. Dobre. Jasné? Dobre. Dobre sa padlo. Aha. Čúra. Palsky. Soplavy. Čo ste spravili práve? Opol som ti auto, ty kokos. I never thought that I will call police, but I had enough. You know, this guy was just... He almost smashed my camera and... When he noticed that I'm calling police, he decided to leave immediately with one last... Um, spit. At this point, police was already on the line, but I've tried to explain the situation, but then I was like, you know what, uh, he's gone. You don't need to care about this, goodbye. And yeah, he was gone. I finished the painting, but the whole mood was gone and it was just... Uh... I was thinking about it a lot and I could react in a different way, you know. Some people might say that I should punch him first, but you really don't want to have a street fight when you paint a... You want to finish your painting, but I could be really, really calm. And, you know, I understand why he was pissed, but the way how he behaved was just completely... Make your own opinion about it. You can let me down there in the comments below. What do you think about this situation? And, yeah, this is what happened to me. And, yeah, I wish that the guy approached me with a different way of communication but on the other hand i know that a lot of writers don't communicate with public politely or with respect so this might be message also for us artists to treat people with respect and yeah that's it i'll see you in the next video